Welcome back, Survivors. Disturb Z here, and we are back in Foundation. All right, so what do we got here? Foundation or Fountain Sculpture Masterpiece. Your skillful management of food during the bad weather has inspired some of your villagers, and they wish to build a Fountain Sculpture Masterpiece to honor the occasion. Optional bonus effect. Building maintenance cost is decreased by 50%. Ooh, very, very well. We've got, wow, I just loaded into the game and that just popped up. So, obviously, we're doing something good. We, we're managing our food very, very well here. All right, so let me come down here. Let me pop into this. Let's see, we've got, we've already done that one. We have the fountain sculpture masterpiece. Um, Where should we put you? I kind of want to put you, I mean, we have one here. So I kind of want to put this one over here, like for these guys, to help kind of get their stuff going. I don't know. Oh, these are unique. How big is? Oh, it's big. Okay. <laughs> I was gonna say maybe I could put it right here and be like centralized, but no, that's that's a pretty hefty little statue thing we've got going on. So let me see. Let me line that up. We'll put that down. Let's see. We've got a small pedestal and a pedestal, huh? Okay, so if I put that there, can I put these? We can put little pedestals down. I can't really see, though. It's all, like, white on white. Yeah, they need to add some, like, color to that because that's super difficult to see right now. Uh, so we'll do that. And that's just marble and stuff, yeah. Okay, see, we're going to have to figure out some sculptures at some point so we can finish these. Um, I don't have any gold, so... Or maybe, I don't know. Huh. I don't know. I want to put a gold one in the middle, I think, honestly. Move you down and put, put you up there. Start construction. We'll get to the gold eventually. So we're going to do that. And, you know, while we're at it, because I know this is, yeah, that's what I thought. Let me go ahead. I'm going to remove some of this i'm gonna remove all of this reforestation over here because to me it's not being reforested for whatever reason anymore and yeah i'm just i'm not gonna have it i am not gonna have it i will do i will do that instead I'm going to, I don't know, part of me wants to, part of me wants to extract that amount of trees. Okay, we've got new people coming in. Good, great, awesome. Okay, oh, behold, the bad weather is now behind us. What a relief. Alright, so we've got this area knocked out. I can remove all of that. That's awesome. Let's see. They've already built this path. So that doesn't need to be a thing anymore. Because that path is pretty much established. And we are trying to chop down that stuff as well. And then I'd kind of like, I don't know, hold on, let me, yeah, here we go. I'd kind of like that to be a little bit wider of a path, a little bit more predominant. Building complete, cheese maker. 
Okay, we got another cheese maker right there. So we've got two cheese makers. Let me max out. Okay, that one's those, both of those are maxed out. Let me see my list of jobs. Does anyone is anyone behind on workers? Does anyone? Oh, we do. Uh, good stall, good stall, granary. I need a person for the granary. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember now. I remember now. We have we have people. So we need things. Um, my clothing. We're down to eight. I just now remembered that from the other day. I need to I need to pause it, and I need to see what my resources are at. Our sheep have zero wool. Okay, that's the bakery. Our there's no cloth. And we have 50 cloth there. Okay, how about our warehouses? Uh, nothing there. We have we have cloth. Okay, so what I need is another another tailor. In order to build our stuff, I need another tailor's workshop. So yeah, we're gonna go ahead. Get this bad boy and I'm gonna put it like right here across from that one. I know that that's killing my sheep on their little little area here, but I think we're gonna end up moving the sheep at some point as well anyway, so I don't know. Maybe this will be like a little sheep island or something. I haven't quite figured out what I wanna do yet. Okay, let's go ahead, unpause, speed it back up. We'll let things run here for a few minutes. Let's see, where is... Okay, so there's no one really hanging out there. Nobody's really over here. Okay, so we have other goods workshops that we just haven't got to yet. And that's why we have the stuff like that. Um... Employment is average, so we're going to get average chances, so that's not bad. We'll keep it like that until we get a good supply of people in. Oh, got a yellow alert. Could not find boar. He still can't find them, huh? So, I know some of y'all had said something about maybe, like, pre-existing forest or maybe a different type of like tree or something like that and that's what i'm trying to figure out here guys because like i i don't know I, i'm trying to i know this probably isn't isn't gonna do anything but i mean I mean, he can hunt here. He can hunt all of this. You know, to me, there I would say there'd be some pigs living in there. I don't know. Maybe it's not old growthy enough. I don't know. I've been kind of like looking around on the map, trying to see if I see any animals walking around. And I haven't really noticed anything. So, I don't know if that's a thing or... If it's just, like, not a big enough area and I'm going to have to have, like, an actual big area to hunt in. So, that's, you know, that's the thing. Maybe, maybe I have to buy, like, this whole island over here and make this whole island to hunt ground or something. I don't know. I really do not know. Right now, I can't buy nothing because we are broke as a joke. Alright, I think it's about time to start setting up our cheese to be sold. Uh, let's see here. Uh, markets. Okay, so I don't have a food vendor set up for this one yet. Let me... What is that? A luxury... Wait, what? Good stall and a luxury good stall. Oh, I bet that's for, like, jewelry and stuff. Okay, okay. Oh, yeah, okay. So I might want to change some stuff up a little bit here. Maybe. 
just maybe. Okay, so I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna put. Yeah, I'm gonna bring him out just a tiny bit. We don't have the gold to start that though. Oh, there we do. Yep, go ahead and start that bad boy. Let's see, let's get over here. Um, I got an unused now. That one's just for the I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to add to all of these. Okay. Gonna have to add to them, that's fine. Completely, completely fine. Let's see, let me bring that back up. Put that there. Put that over the top of that. Start construction on that one. And then the only one that we have set up is way over here. And no, 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 we don't even have that one set up. Okay, so yeah, it's going to take, it's going to take a little bit. Oh, they done made their house a little bit bigger over here. That's cool. Yeah, we'll wait. We'll let these people come down here and do their thing. I almost guarantee the second I start doing the, the cheese... My money's going to skyrocket back up. Okay. We've got you. Let me put you on cheese. If you please. Okay. Who did we assign here to the cheese stall? Mail number 1818. Like I said, they need some more names for this stuff. We need to we need to send them like a list of names already pre-made so that they can just enter them in and you know all that kind of stuff. We need some Wilfrids and some Hildegards and some I don't know it other other medieval-y name. I don't know. Is that a medieval name? I don't even know. Those are medieval. I'm just making stuff up at the moment, but it sounds good, so. Alright, so we're still lacking. Oh, okay. I guarantee it's the people that are way up here that are lacking religion. Yeah, I bet you so. And I'm not gonna build a big church up there just yet. Promotions are available. All right, let's see what we can do. Probably not much because we only have 60 gold, so... Ooh, yeah. Sorry, guys. I, I promoted as many of y'all as I can. All right, so we still got a good bit of unemployed here. Actually, let me... There it is. Yep. Let me get you assigned. Uh, those are good stalls. I don't have people ready for those yet. Got sawmill. Let me add to there. Oh, tailor. I need my tailor. Assign a tailor. Got that. Uh, transporter. We'll assign someone there. We'll assign someone there. And we'll assign someone here as well. Okay. Alright, now I am out of peoples. Oh, I was going to say, I, hey, I got enough for a promotion and then it took it away. And then it took it away. Yeah, y'all, y'all like build up my money real fast so I can promote some of these guys. They need houses. They need places to live. All right. So obviously we're kind of we're kind of struggling here. Um, let me go ahead and pay you. I think at this point I'm ready to go do a military mission because all of our guys 
are fully trained. I've got 14 people. I don't know if 14 people is enough, but... We, like, literally have 20 days to send soldiers, so, yeah. This is going to go one of two ways. Either we're going to, like, get it good... Or we're going to get totally wiped out. One of the two. I don't I don't know how many soldiers we're supposed to be sending here. Uh, my lord, things are boiling up between the realm and our evil neighbors. I personally don't know what it is all about. But the king is requesting your help. Of course, you'll be rewarded according to your war effort. The road ahead will be with uncertainties. So better be prepared. I'll prepare my troops and deploy them right away. See, it says 100% chance of gold reward, 100% chance of a common reward. I don't know what that means, but you know what? Let's let's do it. Success probability impossible. Oh, hold on, hold on. Let me... I'm going to send them all. I'm going to send them all. We are going to march on them. All right, send them off. There goes our little soldiers. Where they're going, I don't know, but <laughs> there's some that are stuck. Oh, no, that's where they grouped up at. Okay. Now they're, now they're marching. Now they're marching. All right, what do y'all want? Y'all want wood. You know what? You are in luck because I has wood to spare. That actually brings me down to 257, which means now all my woodcutters can probably start going back to normal, I think. Almost. We, we need to get a little bit cut out from over here. Well, you know, I say that. I might just put up a new wood camp over there somewhere. Yeah, that's probably what I'm going to end up doing. Okay, let me go ahead and set this back as an extraction zone. And then I'll also set this back up. Alright, y'all do your thing with the wood. So we got a we got a little bit of this carved out over here, I think. So what I'll probably do is once we get money, I'll probably buy like this section of land right here. Yeah, because that's going to be a nice big chunk. Oh, there goes our dudes right here. They're marching. Hold on. I want to I wanna get down here and watch them pass by. Oop. I'm not sure what I did. I clicked something and it beeped at me. Look at them. Yes. Y'all go. Y'all do things. For the name of the king. For the glory. All right. Well, I don't know how long it takes for those little missions to accomplish but it says soldiers are abroad on failure negative five Ew. well it's a good thing i had 14 guys that i sent out 14 fully trained fully armed novice soldiers they are novice and that's why i sent 14 of them 
They're going to do the buddy system. We're going to have seven, seven teams. Okay, we got a couple people joining us. That's always good. There we go. There we go. There is our income. It's back up. Well, it's it went back up. It's going back up. We're doing things. Whoa, where'd all my where'd all my numbers up here go? Why did it flash and disappeared like that's odd that is odd now I did hear that on I think the next update they're talking about like redoing the UI on all this stuff so we might have like some better menus it might be easier to navigate it might be harder to navigate honestly I don't know let's see okay so what do we have we need sculptures so, is there a person that builds sculptures? Like, hold on here. Uh, that's tax office. That is trade bonus. Monastery, herb garden, wine production, apiary, builder's workshop, stained glass, and monk statue. So, do we have anybody right now that can build... What does the cooperage do? They make barrels. Yeah, see, we don't. Maybe that's maybe that's not in the game yet. Maybe that's not a thing. I don't. I don't know. Um, that's cool looking. Yeah, I really don't know. I'm going to have to look into that and see what I'm missing to get to get some of these people cuz I don't know. Yeah, I just I don't know. I mean, the monastery doesn't do it, does it? I mean, I wouldn't think so, but... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Builder's Workshop Sculpture. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Do I need to upgrade? <gasps> That's what it is. Oh, man, we've been... Okay, that's why we haven't been building statues, is because our builder deal didn't have its uh, didn't have its add-on. That's what it is. Oh, my lord, your troops have been very helpful regarding the matter with our evil neighbors. That said, the matter seems far from being resolved yet, and we still need your help. Uh, you can keep my troops with you. Send soldiers to help the king. Difficulty average, distance far, success probability extreme. Okay, or maybe another time and I can bring them back. Okay, so it says difficulties average, but I have an extreme possibility. So you know what? I'm going to say keep my troops and give me whatever reward you're giving me. Okay, I have no clue where the reward is or how I get my reward, but we're going to let them run one more time, and then if they win or lose, we'll bring them back. Hopefully they'll win. It said it had an extreme chance of probability, so, I mean, hopefully. 
We'll see. We will see. Alright, we're going to get these little sculpture deals. Yeah, I can't believe I forgot about that. I'd seen it one day and then just totally spaced out on how to do the statues. Four people are joining the village. Nice. Wow, they're, uh, they're ahead. All right, well, we're probably going to get some stuff going here in a minute, then. This is exciting. I'm liking this. Oh, yeah, they're almost done. Yep, they're going to be finished first. They are going to be finished first. There we are. Okay, so I got to assign assign villagers to those. Okay, I got you. they're doing things nice we're gonna have our little fountains here probably next episode we'll probably have our fountains done but that's good because i don't remember what all they do but we're supposed to get some bonuses i think so haha -ha. gotta love bonuses got to love the bonuses so what we'll probably do is we'll probably grow the village a little bit bigger and then I'm probably going to come down here and make this guy, like, bigger. Oh, my lord, we are victorious again. Still, there's the last battle to be fought. It's going to be no easy task, though. Decide wise. It says we have an extreme probability. Do it. Do it. We're going all in. We're pushing all the chips in. Maybe we'll get a big reward. Maybe, like, you know, we'll gain some sort of knighthood or, like, lord title or something. I don't know. Y'all know how that stuff works. I don't. <laughs> I do not. Oh, they're bringing a sculpture. Okay, so... So they build them at their little shop. Yeah, there they are. They're working on them right there. And then they bring a sculpture over. Alright, did we get one brought in? Not yet. Not yet. Hoping to get this bad boy going so that, like, all of these houses just, like, instantly upgrade when it's time. Might be a while before I get another territory. We're kind of kind of struggling right now. I need to promote some people so I can get some more more taxes. I thought they were bringing a sculpture over. Or am I just not seeing it? Because it says bird automation. Oh. There we go. Oh, they upped it. They got the basin in. And then this one's doing that. I don't know. Do we even have gold bars? 
I mean, I don't even know if we have gold bars, so. Soldiers, we're victorious. Okay. Where are they coming back from? Over here again? Hopefully I didn't lose any. Ha! Huh. Alright, so what do I get for the reward? Because it's showing me negative 50 now. Even though it's showing... Oh, because I'm buying through trade. Yes, because we're out of tools. I'm buying the tools right now. Yeah, 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 yeah. I got you. Okay, hold on. So let me go ahead and do this. Let me set up trade. Let's see who is buying what. Um, nobody wants cheese? Seriously? Oh, I was going to sell some people some cheese. Promotions are available. Oh, yeah, we can do two promotions. That's so... That's so nice. The tailor and I guess the builder can be both promoted. Military missions available. I want to know how come I didn't get a reward. Like, what is this gold reward? What is the other one? Like, oh, here we go. Okay, hold. Whoa, 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 whoa. We just got rewarded big time. 1235 on the gold coins. We got rewarded 54 bread, 34 iron, and five tools, and two polished stone. That's actually pretty good. I mean, I don't care about the polished stone. The tools are nice to have, and then the iron, uh, hey, that means I don't have to buy iron. Bread's always a good thing. And then that gold, that gold puts us back up in, like, a good spot here. Okay, I'm trying to yeah, trying to get the stuff off. We've got our promotions. I'm gonna go ahead and promote all of these guys. Oh, what do we got here? Promotions. We can do these for free. Oh, they are now soldiers. Nice. Very, very, very nice. And I think I'm gonna go ahead and promote some more of my commoners as well. I'm going to do one here, one there. I'm going to try to do the higher level ones. I'm trying to keep them to like level five and whatnot. Do you? Oh, there's a level six. I missed it somehow. Yeah, we'll do that and we'll keep this 400 something because I know we're going to, it's going to hurt us here in a bit, so... All right, guys. Well, whoa, your army is growing stronger. We will offer you some more challenging missions from now on. Long live the loot -er king. Okay. All right, guys. Well, we did things. We did some, we did some military missions. We got all the way through. So 14 people fully trained uh, at novice level will get you through all three missions. Or at least it got me through all three missions. So that's good to know. We figured out the sculpture thing, so our guys are building sculptures for this fountain and for this fountain over here. So both of those are coming along nicely. I am going to need to get some gold at some point, so I'm probably going to have to set that up here pretty soon. Trade in some gold for the statues and knock these out because I think once we knock these out our costs are going to like drop dramatically and we should have like a good, good, good inflow for quite a while, especially once we get that 50% knocked out and all of our maintenance is like super cheap. Yeah, that's going to be a good one. But anyway, guys, that is going to do it for today's video. I do hope everybody has enjoyed it. If you have, be sure to hit that like button. And if you haven't already, do me a favor, hit that subscribe button. It is an awesome, awesome, awesome way for you to show your support to me, to the channel, to the video, and to the game itself. And as always, feel free to share the video on any social media you're using. And guys, just like to stop and take a moment and thank each and every one of y'all 
for all of your wonderful, awesome support, all the comments, all the likes, all the subscribers, and all the videos shared. It is awesome, and I do appreciate it. And with that being said, until next time, survivors, keep on surviving.